29 years old, male with ascites and abdominal pain. Late phase of Pottery syndrome. Here we see a heterogeneous texture of the liver and extensive ascites in the pouch of Morrison. Here we see a different ecogenicity in the parenchyma peripherally and this is the central liver. By the transverse section we see enlarged caudate lobe and nearby sagittal section we see the enlarged left lobe the enlarged caudate lobe and this is here behind the abdominal wall the left lobe transverse section this is the left lobe and this is the caudate lobe which is enlarged And this is the portal vein. It appears abnormal, narrowed here. And this is the pancreas, which is normal. Spectral Doppler analysis of the hepatic artery. And here is the portal vein. Here we see ascites. During spectral Doppler analysis of the portal vein, the right branch we see hepatofugal flow. Here we see it by color Doppler, by blue color. The ecotexture of the liver is heterogeneous. And hyperechoic. Here we see the IVC which is patent. This is the IVC. Here we see the heterogeneity of ecotexture again and here the large codet lobe these are the contours of the codet lobe which is enlarged this is the codet lobe And here we see the IVC. And here in this transverse section, we see the IVC here. And we see the, the right hepatic vein, which is fibrotic here ecogenic this is a late phase of pot chiari syndrome right hepatic vein and yet we see it in sagittal section and here in this section we see the gallbladder which is thickened and contracted, which is a feature of pot carry syndrome. In this transverse section here at the helium of the liver, we see 
the pulsatility of the hepatic artery with a blue color which is entering the liver and the portal vein in red color which is towards the probe which means hepatofugal flow This is the portal vein flow. Splenomegaly is around 16 centimeters. So we have many features of Pat Curie syndrome. Enlarged caudate lobe, heterogeneous ecotexture of the liver and ascites. Here we see heterogeneity of the eco pattern and the patomegaly and abdominal ascites. The portal vein is abnormal, small in caliper and with reversed flow by color Doppler. Hepatofogal flow, which is slow and weak. Absent hepatic veins. This is a fibrotic hepatic vein, thickened edematous gallbladder wall and splenomegaly.